Hey everyone, it's Orlando Streets, and this is a strange one. There's a Walmart and a Publix in the same parking lot. I've never seen this before. At least I thought I hadn't seen this before, but as it turns out, I have filmed this Walmart, which is right over there, 11 months ago. And I don't know if I just didn't realize it, but there's a Publix right there. <laughs> And I could have filmed in the same day, but I didn't. So 11 months ago, I was here. I filmed the Walmart. Today, I'm here to film the Publix, which is a user request. So that's what we're going to do today. Uh, I hope you can see that Walmart right over there. And I'll post a link at the end of the video to that review or that walkthrough of that Walmart. It's really windy today. I'm trying to keep the camera close to my mouth, but... so you can hear me. So the address of that Walmart over there is 3838 Semeron, I think we're on Semeron Boulevard, is it? Anyway, if you just look for Walmart 3838, that'll pull up that video. So let's go check out this Publix. And I'm just going to put a map up real quick right now. So take a look at this map. And this is where we are. Ooh, there's a plane landing right there. So we're not far from the Orlando International Airport, which is in that direction. So they've got a uh, pharmacy drive through right over there. And uh, it's a neat looking store, gotta be honest. Curious what it looks like inside. I, I try not to look at the pictures on the Google Maps of the stores before I come. I, I wanna be surprised. So the address here is 4042. Ah, you know, I need a good view of the front of the store for a thumbnail. Guess that's going to be about it. It's kind of dark. That's, that's it right there. Go around this car here. So it looks like a thriving shopping center. Look at all the cars. Very, very busy. It's a nice size. Lots of choices. So they got flowers up front, the restrooms, bakery in the front, deli on the side. Oh, they're in, okay. Got uh, empanadas. That's what these are. 
ham and cheese and banana, hot spinach with cheese and banana, hot beef and banana, and hot chicken and banana. Oh, that's cool. I'm good, thanks. this before. It's a chicken and waffle sandwich. Oh boy, I have to try that. $4.99. Yeah, I'll just grab this one here. Bananas are still 69 cents a pound. Let's see, uh, organic head of lettuce is $2.99. $1.99 if it's not organic. And a bag, looks like a bag of celery is going to set you back. $2.49. ounces of the best orange juice here in Florida. And we've got a container of strawberries here for $3.99, 16 ounces. these but um, that's chicken thighs okay well anyway the chicken thighs are 249 a pound A pound. 
pound. Oh, it's 22 ounces, excuse me. Not a pound. Okay, a pound of bacon here, $9.99. This is good bacon though, black label. This is their brand here, $5.59 for a pound. And their milk's in the back corner, $4.65 a gallon. for a dozen eggs. Let's see, and their generic white bread now is two sixty seven for a loaf. Four sticks is seven sixty-seven. The generic is two for eight dollars. And a pound of cheese is five ninety-nine. see their blood pressure machine, but they do have a scale here. There are 16 aisles. And there is their blood pressure machine right there. It's a hickey. There is no trackpad. Oh, carbon check on the channel. Sensodyne oh, is seven sixty seven. About a buck more than Walmart, I think. Let's see, a can of shaving cream is two ninety nine for Gillette, and Barbasol is two ten. So this Publix has a brown ceiling. Uh, I say that because usually it's either, I believe it's black or white, usually. Uh, look at all these cards.
We've got quite a selection of paper towels here. They've got some... Um, I've seen this before. I think these are, yeah, 100% recycled. Seventh generation. And then they have Scott and Sparkle. Generic, Brawny, Bounty. Bounty is half of it right there. Oh wow, look at this, look at this roll. Look at this roll. Look at this thing. Okay. Check this out. Okay, these are 179 here. Look at this. Wow. Brawny. Our biggest roll, yeah, I would say. That's pretty cool. Decent collection of wine here and beer. Oh, they've got these garlic knots in the frozen section. They have. Um, both say made with real garlic. Oh, one is seasoned and the other is chive and onion. people ask me to look to look at the ice cream and I don't remember what they wanted me to look at so um, I think yeah I'm just not really sure I don't know completely forgot so we'll just look and see what they have here they've got um, lactate green wise which is Publix brand Here is 689. Mayfield. Eddie's. Bluebell. Tillamook. Again, these are the ice cream brands that they have here at Publix. Haagen Dazs. Yeah, I think I made note of this before. Look how small these things are. Can you see that? Probably looks big on video, but it's 3.6 ounces for $1.75. And Ben and Jerry's. Now this is one brand someone wanted me to look at. I do remember that. And they have a little Ben and Jerry's here for $1.65. It's four fluid ounces, so it's a little bit bigger than the Haagen Dazs, and it's 10 cents less. Um, they have Dirt Cake, Netflix and Chilled, Brown Batter, Give Me Some More, um, and Pretzily Fudged, Pistachio, Pistachio, Fish Food, Salted Caramel, The Tonight Dough, is that Jimmy Kimmel? I'm not sure, I don't know. Uh, someone will correct.
correct me later. I don't know these guys. I don't watch late night TV, so. Americone Dream. Looks like strawberry cheesecake. Strawberry cheesecake. Chocolate caramel cookie dough. The Tonight Dough. Half baked. Mint chocolate cookie. Peanut butter cup. Chunky Monkey. Milk and cookies and vanilla. The Talenti. I do like Talenti. It's gelato. It's delish. And then they have Baskin Robbins. Godiva. They have three containers of Godiva. Jenny's. Madison Brown, another one Godiva, another Godiva, some Godiva back there. Um, so, so delicious. Some more Ben and Jerry's. Cherry Garcia, okay, that's one I didn't see over there. Dairy frozen dessert. This is probably what someone was looking for and what they have. It's non-dairy. This is, um, oh, this is Publix brand. Okay, that's cool. Craig's. So delicious on the bottom. Enlightened brand, that's Greek frozen yogurts. Kato, which is avocado frozen dessert. Rebel. Nix. 360 calories per pint. Oh, it's Halo Top. And Keto. And that's looks like that's it. I may have missed something. I tried to get it all for you guys, okay? I'm gonna have to show you all of these different pizzas. Yep. Uh, just go through it real quick. Totino's, DiGiorno, Red Baron. The Red Baron right now is 623. Tombstone, Publix Generic. Those look good, don't they? Flatbreads. Those pictures look amazing. And then they have, what is this brand? Oh, that's Publix. Okay, it must be their premium pizza. And then the Screamin' Sicilian. Newman's Own, still around. Freshetta. California Pizza Kitchen. It is $9.99 for 11.8 ounces. I'm sure it's good though. And then Greenweiss, which is their Publix brand. Amy's Pizza. Daya. Elios. There's another one here. Montelli. Montelli. Okay, so they've got a 
got a lot of, look at all that tide. And then Purcell and Gain All, that's what I use. OxyClean, Arm and Hammer, Woolite, Purex. Abandoned carts. I do not know why it is abandoned. Oh, it's all alone. Nobody around. This is something that I don't buy anymore. It's uh, popcorn, microwave popcorn. It's $6.99 and you get six bags for $7. Orville Redenbacher, Pop Secrets, Skinny Girl, Jolly Time. Oh, this is cute, I haven't seen this before. Um, seasoning. It's three ninety nine, and a can of Pringles now is two seventy nine. So I was just buying cat food the other day at Walmart and I noticed the cans were 88 cents each. Oh, look at this, 88 cents. Yeah, same price here. And they have a much better selection, usually at Publix. So it's something to think about if you have a cat. They are liking this one right now, so I'm gonna grab these. I just walked down this aisle. Why am I doing this? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I already came down this aisle. I didn't remember. I forgot. I apologize. Thank you. Okay, check it out. So Pepsi is four bucks. For a two liter bottle, four dollars. You can get a generic bottle of soda, four for five dollars. And you get a two liter bottle of Coke for $3.69. Box of mac and cheese now is one ninety one. Okay, I think these are still around a dollar at Walmart. Maybe just over a dollar.
These stores are always busy. It's just amazing. Okay, if you like ranch dressing like I do, 16 ounces, $4.11. Okay, this is aisle number three. We've got all your taco fix-ins here, except for your meat, obviously. And your soups, $1.99 for a can of soup. Book 99. Okay, it's cereal, cereal aisle. Coffee. Okay, so they've got a big generic can of coffee here. $12.49, Folgers $11.99. $6.49 for 67 ounces. Oh, look at this. Look at this can here. That's cool looking. Illy. Illy Classico coffee. 8.8 .8 ounces. It's like a aluminum can. 1019. And of course, Cafe Boost. Bustello. Cafe Bustello. 5.99. Oh, they got Mia Amiga here. Cheerios Friends. Cinnamon Toast Crunch Churros. $5.46. Ooh, that looks so healthy. That's it. Okay, they do not have self-checkout here. Do not have self-checkout. So the total cost of the order was 1961. All right, I see my car way out there. So, uh, hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, thumbs up. Um, subscribe to and uh, check out that other video I did 11 months ago at the Walmart. So that should be on your screen right now. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.